my fellow witches and welcome back to my channel. Today I'll be unboxing the Antipodian Witch Double Box for September 2020. So that's their standard moon theme monthly box and their book and brew box. As usual this is not a sponsored video but I will leave a link in the description below if you want to check them out. Due to the size of the box and also because I want to change it up a little bit from how I normally film I'll be moving this to the side and showing you the items as I pull them out. So into the box. So first up we have the information pamphlet. So this month is the fish moon for September. So I'll leave that in case I need to refer to it. So the first item in the box is the big one which is why the box is probably the bigger size this month. And it's this beautiful glass flower vase. So with a star coming up, um, it'll make a great altarpiece to put some nice spring flowers in there. So it's nice sturdy glass. We have the first of our herbs, which is some turmeric chips. So I know we've had the turmeric fingers before, but um, I do like the chips because I find they fit into spell bottles a lot easier. You're not having to break them in half. We have some chamomile flowers. So, and we have jasmine flowers I love the smell of jasmine it's a it's one of my preferred floral scents the next item we have is looks like the incense so just the normal three incense it's got a Kind of a, a light, a sweet light scent, not too heavy. And so our first crystal is a tiger eye. So this piece of tiger eye there. We have piece of citrine so, I, I do like the raw cut stuff as well as the tumbled so it's nice that you get a bit of a mixture occasionally and we have a golden healer cord the crystals for the month and we have this piece of ribbon which I would assume is part of the, the monthly moon ritual so there will probably be something to do with that in there we have a jewellery item so we have a necklace with a pentagram a bit unusual, not used to seeing it with the backing like that, but something different. And it's on a, a rope ish cord, not like a leather or a chain. Uh, what else we have? Looks like we have a feather, which is probably something to do with the ritual as well. have our candles, little spell candles. It looks like this one's been broken in transit which does happen but still usable. Um, I like to use these ones, uh, the broken ones, for uh, sealing bottles, spell bottles, spell jars, that sort of stuff rather than spells. We have 
some consecrated sugar and salt scrub hope and it says it's got chamomile petals in it down to the last few items of the standard box and this lovely carved altar tile I'm assuming so it's got some little rabbits on it and it looks like some eggs that represent four, the four elements so with a star coming up it will make a great great addition to, the, to your altar And then the last item of the standard box is the sigil and affirmation card. So again, the theme is hope. And the affirmation says, I know that I have the courage to choose to hope. My heart, mind and soul are open to all the hopeful, wonderful possibilities of life. A lovely affirmation. I really like these cards. They're, they're great to sort of help channel things, feelings and stuff. So now we're on to the book and brew section of the box. So it's at the bottom. We have, so this month the tea is called spring turmeric tisane is that how you pronounce it so it's lemongrass ginger turmeric hibiscus and calendula petals and it's a caffeine free tea so it looks like she's sending them back in the bamboo um, which is I, I, I do like them but I just tend to find um, when it's been hot uh, they, they split for some reason but you get a good amount in there so I uh, don't know about any of you that got the box last month but I wasn't I wasn't a big fan of the tea with the rice in it it um, wasn't as it wasn't as enjoyable as most of the other teas that we've we've got so I'll be keen to Try that one. And one of the little bonus parts for getting the two box is a little incense cone holder. So I like these ones because I've got two little kidlets, so it keeps little fingers off hot burning incense. And the book for this month is candle magic so I like utilizing candles in the things that I do so this will be another book that um, will get well used so that was so that was everything for this month so I'd have to say I've got three favourite items from this month's box. The vase is one. It's a nice size. I can put lots of flowers on my altar. And it kind of looks like a pumpkin, which I think is really cute. The wooden altar tile. Uh, most of the stuff on my altar has that wooden carved aesthetic. So that'll fit nicely in there. And the candle magic book. I've been drawn more and more to candle magic. Um, so that, that should have a lot of information in there for me. So well I hope you liked the video and I hope you liked the new layout. I'm preferring it this way. I think it just gives a little bit more of a, a surprise for you all. So uh, let me know in the comments what your favourite item was. If you like this layout and if you liked the video don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. And until the next video, merry part and merry meet again.